and particularly in the east, there'll also be some sunshine. Most of that will be in the west, and here temperatures will be close to the average for this time of the year. It also looks like the heat wave is on its way out across southeast Europe. Temperatures throughout the weekend will be much closer to the sort of temperatures you'd expect at this time of the year. But across central Europe, it's going to stay rather cool. In fact, cold enough for some snow over the highest peaks of the Alps. And that could well affect the cyclists as they ride from Briançon to Courchevel on Sunday in the Tour de France. So many central and northern parts of Europe will be unsettled through the weekend. Temperatures up to 30 degrees in Moscow, but through much of the Mediterranean it could be dry with plenty of sunshine. That's sunny weather extending right the way down across the Canary Islands. Now back home we've got a bit of a battle going on at the moment between low pressure towards the east and high pressure out to the west. And the high is going to stay to the west throughout the weekend, so most of the sunshine will be in western areas. Then at the beginning of next week that high pressure system is going to push its way across the United Kingdom. Now I'm not saying it's going to be a hot and sunny spell of weather, but at least it'll be dry and settled and there'll be some sunshine around. Now the wind is going to be a real feature of the weather throughout the rest of today and the weekend. It's going to be coming from the north or the northwest and it's going to be quite brisk. But the strongest wind will always be in eastern areas. So if you can get into any sunshine further west, it shouldn't feel too bad at all. Now at the moment we have a lot of cloud around. There is a little bit of brightness about, but there are also quite a few showers. You can see those showers here on the radar picture. And we're likely to continue to see some showers on and off throughout the rest of the afternoon with quite a lot of cloud around, but a little bit of brightness or sunshine, particularly in some southern areas where we could see temperatures peaking at around 19 or 20 degrees. But further north it will feel quite cool as we see temperatures up to 16 to 18 degrees and still in that brisk north or northwesterly wind. Then tonight we'll see further showers in northern and eastern areas. It's not going to be cold, temperatures no lower than 9 or 10 degrees. So we start with a lot of cloud and some showers in eastern areas through tomorrow. Those showers will become confined to southeastern parts though as the afternoon goes on. For the west there'll be a good deal of dry and fine weather around. Spells of sunshine too, lifting temperatures to between 18 and 21 degrees. Then on Sunday a similar sort of thing. We'll have more in the way of cloud in eastern areas. Many places though will stay dry. Further towards the west that's where we see most of the sunshine and that sunshine will lift temperatures up as high as between 18 and 20 degrees. That's the forecast.